ProAccuMaster is a proven, easy-to-use, analog geophysical locator designed by GDI that is now also available in a digital version. AccuMaster Digital features a bright LED scale for target identification with resistivity OHM values, viewable under low-light conditions, and high-powered voltage signal for ground scanning. Operation is quite simple. Position the four probes to the ground on a square format. Clip their wires to the probes and connect the plugs to the numbered jacks of the AccuMaster panel. Make several probe squares not only to the suspected spot, but to the surrounding area also, to test ground readings for this soil and determine the average resistivity value for your ground. Each test switch scans the area between a set of probes. Total six pairs of probes can be scanned by holding their corresponding test switch for about a second. Here's an example how the locator works for treasure hunting. Start scanning the probe pairs and a noticeable low value is received on the bottom set, for example. Now move all four probes towards that direction and scan again. Lower readings continue and improve. Again, shift the probes towards the lowest reading. The target has been centered once all pairs produce identical extremely low values. For void hunting, position probes on a straight line. Scan the three probe pairs and keep moving the probes one to two meters parallel to cover new lines. A void-like tunnel or tomb produces extremely high values between one or more probe pairs according to its size. To get depth reading for a metal target, use the pair of probes that gave the lower value and start moving those two probes even closer to each other, as long as the readings keep dropping lower.
Once readings stabilize or start to increase, divide by 2 the distance between the probes where the best, lowest reading occurred to find the depth. On the opposite for void, start moving closer each other the probes of the pair that displays the higher reading until it stops the increase. Now divide by 2 the distance between the probes where the best, highest reading was obtained to find